What's going on guys, Duggernaut here, and today I'm going to be bringing you another video on gathering. Uh, today we're going to be talking about overmelding, and what materials to be using in what slots to maximize overmeld to both get uh, 1200 gathering and 1200 perception, with still having over 700 uh, GP, so that way you can get all of the legendary nodes, whether it's uh, Terraria Logs, whether it's Palladium, Rhea, you'll be able to get all of that and be able to start gathering it at high quality so here's my current uh here is my current setup right now as you can see i have 1200 gathering i have 1200 perception and i have 720 gp and that is all unbuffed no food nothing we're going to start looking at the accessories so with the accessories, it's pretty simple. They, they can you can get them to cap very easily. What you're gonna want to do is for all of the uh, the main slots, because uh, all all five accessories are pretty much gonna have the same uh, build out. Is you're gonna put uh, GP six, and that's gonna cap. Uh, that'll cap pretty much the four items. This one you can have a little bit more. I think they let you cap at eleven. Not that big of a deal. So you put uh, GP6 in, and then they can both cap at uh, 12 Perception and 12 Gathering. So for those, you're just going to be able to use the Grade 4s. Um, order really doesn't matter. Because they're all the same quality material, you can go Perception first, you can go Gathering first, you can go Perception Gathering, Perception Gathering. Doesn't matter, but this is the overall, this is the, um, the best meld for these items. Next, you want to look at um, the main and offhand. <clears throat> this is where things start to get a little frustrating because you, again, you know, when you're, when you're like, oh, it's only 17%, it's only 10%, 7%, 5%. I've gotten lucky. I've gotten it on my first. I've, I, you know, I went through maybe 30 or 40 materia before I got one. You know, it, it's all RNG based. Um... The offhand, you're going to put the Perception 15, which is a grade 6, in the first slot, guaranteeing it. And then the, you're going to do three Perception 10s, which is grade 5. And then the last materia is going to be uh, Gathering. On the main hand, we're going to do it the um, Perception as well. Pretty much, you're guaranteeing that 15. And then the rest are all Gathering. Uh, all grade 5. All right, now we're going to look at the left side of the gear. Uh, this is going to be a little bit easier because you're not using um, as many grade 5s. You know, you will be able to start using grade 4s and grade 3s. So, I mean, once once you get the weapon and the offhand, you know, those are the two hardest. Once you get those done, you know, it's, it's less frustrating. For that, uh, let's go ahead and take a look at the helm. So for this, obviously each item will have two open slots, uh, it, except for the belt, obviously it still only has one. So for this, we're going to utilize our grade sixes in there. For the helm, we use two grade six perceptions. Uh, we use a grade five uh, gathering. Uh, I did not have any more grade two uh, perception materia, so I just stuck a three in there. If you have the, uh, you know, the, um, the grade two materia, that's fine. Um, it'll help you with the percentage wise. I just That's all I had uh, and then you want to make sure that you have uh, You know as With any stat left you want to just throw GP in there. So for this uh, I threw a GP 4 uh, For the chest piece you want to do one grade 6 for gathering and one grade 6 for perception and then the rest is going to be um, a two grade five gathering. And then again, if you have a grade two perception, uh, you could stick that in there, but I didn't. So uh, I had to use what I had. All right, for the gloves, what we did is uh, for the first one, we put in a grade six gathering. Then we used a grade four um, Perception twice, and then we used a gathering grade four, and then a ga gathering uh, grade five, and that basically caps it. 
Alright, for the belt, uh, it only has one guaranteed slot, so for that we're going to be putting in the Gathering Materia Grade 6. And I know it caps at 12, but I'd rather have it cap than be short, because the Grade 5 Materia uh, will be short on the Gathering. And again, we're trying to get the cap as, you know, easy as possible without losing anything. We don't want to use food, we don't want to use buffs, etc. Um, then we're going to do two Perception 3 Materias and then two uh, GP3 Materias. Alright, so for the pants now, um, for the guaranteed slot we're going to put in a Grade 6 Gathering Materia and then we're just going to finish off the uh, Gathering Cap. So we're going to put a Grade, you could probably put in a Grade 2 if you have any. Again, I, I just I didn't have any at the time. All I had on my retainer is Grade 3s, 4s, and 5s. Um, you then put in Perception, and then finish it off with uh, GP Materia. And then for the last item for the boots, uh, we're going to go ahead and finish off. We're going to hit the Gathering and Perception cap on both of these. Uh, for the Guaranteed slots, we're putting in two Grade 5 Perception Materias. Uh, we'll then do two uh, GP3, and then the last one is uh, we will put in a uh, Gathering Materia. And that's going to wrap it up for this uh, video, guys. This is how you overmeld to get 1200 gathering and perception. Like I said, there's probably ways to change it up a little bit. Um, I mean, find out what works best for you, what melds work for you. As long as you get to 1200 gathering perception, that's really all that matters, guys. I uh, hope you guys found this video helpful. If you did, go ahead and leave a like. Um, you know, let me know in the comment section down below what melds you guys ended up using. I'll leave in the description um, a, company, uh, a list of everything that I've used. Uh, don't forget to hit that subscribe button for all up-to-date content. And as always, goodbye from Zalara.